everybody, welcome back to the Ice Cloud 2275 stream. Hope you're all doing well this fine day. I'm doing good. Just thought I would let you know that I am back. Um, yeah, uh, just continuing where I left off. Um, where are my words? Uh, doo -doo -doo -doo. Yeah, uh, just going to continue on with the, those more side quests uh, in the autumn. I've, whilst I was making tea and other things, I did top up on my potions. Um, just set another two of these on. Because they are the potions that take the most time. And then, yeah, everything else should be pretty much done. That's cooking, that's cooking, that's cooking, that's going. That's two minutes to go. Alright. So let's switch my appearance back to the appearance I want. There we go. Slacks, trousers, and wizardy skills. Point to there. Sort out his quick quests. Oh, let's see if I've got any demiguy statue. I, I'm not sure if I picked any up. I mean, I might have done, but I never really know. Um, and then yeah, head to Hogsmeade, pick up those side quests, and then do the lost child quest that I have for what's a face. And then yeah, just some. Exploring. Uh, reveal what's at the bottom right of the map. Seems though I've never been there before. Oh, where am I looking? No, yeah, it's this way I want to go. It's you. Talk to me. Hello, Mr. Moon. Oh, greetings, huh? Any luck removing some more of those demiguys statues? I'm sorry to say that I haven't found any more of those statues. How unfortunate. I was hoping you would have. And remove those blasted moons. Okay. I'll, I'll keep an eye out for more demiguys statues and see if I can bring you more moons. I commend you for your courage and valor. Especially since they can only be collected at night. I did not know. Alright, let me check my mic level. I apparently had my mic turned down. Must have knocked it somewhat. How bad was... Ah, it's not too bad either. But we'll just turn it back up to just a... Well, no, back up to max here. And there we go. That should be good. I have no idea if it was broadcasting the extra audio or not. Right. Revelio. Cool. Hello, two. Ramora. There we go. Revelio. Eliza, you were right about bow truckles. I owe you a nut. Miriam. Okay. Alohomora.
Revelio. Nope, that's it for that. Okay. Let's go Hogsmeade, and let's travel there. Let's load in my loading screen. Sorry if there's a smell. New batch of toad hide. Yeah, yeah, I've heard a DLC is uh, coming too, Octavia. Alright, let's go. I want to keep puff skin, but I can sell the Nithla. Sell this toad. Sell that toad. Keep the puff skin and the moon calf. Sell the toad. Sell the Nithla. The Niffler. Hopefully, it's got Wizard Chess and Quidditch. That's what I'm hoping for the DLC. Some Wizard Chess and some Quidditch. Measle fur. Never go wrong with those. Good choice, I'd say. Uh, what else have I got? Grapnel Horn. I suppose I could do more with Dry Cold Feather, but like I can. Hunt for dry calls. I'll not mind seeing you here again. Consider yourself welcome. Uh, what would you hope it's got, Octavia? Uh, for the DLC? Ah, oh, you wanted to build a breeding track for your game. Okay. I mean, unless it's one of the random drops, like the Christmas decorations and things like that are. No um, touching if you have sticky fingers. I suspect you have a sharp eye for fashion. 
Be sure to stop by whenever you're about. Wizard chess isn't here. I, I, I would want me to play some wizard chess. Like, that crushes me that that's not in here as well. And I want some chess where my little, like, random chess pieces obliterate each other. This game needs wizard chess. <laughs> Everything else is not already here. <laughs> I mean, I suppose they've got their own version of, like, snap and trump cards and stuff, but I'm not too bothered about those. I want, like... <laughs> I've turned in the wrong path, haven't I? Yeah, I have. me? Might I ask a favor of you? Hello. Is there something I can help you with? How do you do? I'm Sacrissa Tugwood, and I have an exciting business proposition for you. Now, it may surprise you to learn that someone of my obvious esteemed lineage would be in business. But I only want to help the less fortunate. How magnanimous. Oh, there's more. You see, I've been experimenting with a new beauty cream. A cream that will rid our glorious school of the hideous, greasy pustules plaguing our poor pubescent classmates. But I've run out of the key ingredient, boobatuba pus. Boobatubas do grow in the forbidden forest, however. If only I could pay someone to collect a few for me. What precisely are boobatubas? Disgusting things, really. Covered in protrusions. One needs to squeeze them to collect the pus. They smell simply awful and seem to move on their own. Ugh. I wouldn't go near the things if it weren't for my devotion to my classmates. See, if I knew this wasn't already made by the massive fan group, I would think they're just making things up. Like, what the fuck is a booba tuba? <laughs> How on earth did you discover that booba tuba pus clears one's skin? One cannot rely on spells for all appearance enhancements. The errant cast, for example, could relocate one's eyebrows entirely rather than merely thinning them. My darling and now perpetually surprised-looking neighbor discovered that on her own. Poor thing. I am convinced that beauty potions are the future. I'm forever looking for ways to make this world a more beautiful place. I suspected that if pure boobatuba pus could cause boils, an altered form would likely reverse such abominations. And I was correct. I'll try and find I some for you. I can try and find some for you if I have the time. Marvellous. I'd go myself, but I don't want to. I only need a few boobatubas, but they grow wild, so you'll have to look around. Our spotty classmates are counting on you, so you mustn't tarry. Go to the forest. Into the forbidden North forest for booba tubers. I hope it's worth the risk. Right. That's one of the side quests that was in Hogsmeade. <laughs> the only sane side quest you've seen. Uh... Garnif. Hello. Is something the matter? Most decidedly, yes. My precious moon calf, Biscuit, was abducted by poachers up north. All oh, the vicious brutes. I tried to fight back, but I was no match for them. I'm sorry about your moon calf, Mr. Garnif. Just Garnif. I'm only one goblin. Not a particularly brave one at that. I have no chance against a pack of bloodthirsty poachers. 
Oh, my poor biscuit. I can only hope she's able to escape. A moon calf is an unusual pet. Why did you choose Biscuit? She followed me one evening. I wouldn't leave my side. Never thought I was one for a pet of any kind. But now I can't imagine life without her. Moon calves are often thought of as silly, simple-minded creatures. But I've seen great depth of character in Biscuit. I wouldn't trade her for a hippogriff or a hippopotamus. Or even a goose that lays golden eggs. Why do you suppose the poachers took Biscuit? I have no idea. Mooncalf dung's highly valuable for fertilizing magical plants. But I cannot imagine poachers care much about gardening. Who knows what they'll do to her? She could be flog-skinned, gutted and stuffed. I assume... Oh, Biscuit. Talk about catastrophizing. I'll keep an eye out. I'll keep an eye out for your Mooncalf, Garneth. How kind. If only all of wizard kind was as gracious to goblins. If you do see her and can bring her safely home to me, I promise to reward you for your efforts. Do keep right. an eye out for her, and be careful out there. Poachers are an unscrupulous lot. I should try and rescue Garnish's moon calf. Sounds as if I'd need to head north to find those poachers. Yep. That it does, my friend. Revelio. That it does. It's a shame our plan was to go south. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I don't need any more Thestrals. Um, anyway, yeah, our general plan is to go south. But I want to head around here -ish to start with. Um, yeah, that's the quest I want to head for. The Lost Child, meet Natty in Lower Hogsfield. I don't have any talents, do I? Nope, that'll come later. Actually, that'll come a lot sooner than I was anticipating. Alright, for now. Let's get out of Hogsmeade. Revelio. Time to go a little quicker. Go! That's where I'm looking to be. Then get on your feet. Slow down now. There we go. <laughs> Rebellion. Ah, Nicholas. Okay. Not the things I was looking for. Let's go meet Natty then. Faster! Away!
Natty learned of a wizard in Lower Hogsfield who's been harassed by Lucas Harlow, Rockwood's right hand man. I should meet her there to investigate. Theophilus Harlow came by here looking for Mr. Bickle. Very concerning. I would not want someone like <laughs> How nice to see you, my young friend. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Semi. What can I do for you? What do you have for sale? Ah, yes. A wonderful choice. Might as well. I hope to see you again sometime. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Revelio. Nope, that's just glitched out. There might be a little too many quality control issues in these <laughs> ported titles. Yeah. Good. Is this Mr. Bickle's home? I believe so. He supposedly has evidence against Halo. We need to speak with him. It appears something should ha has happened to Mr. Bickle. I need to speak to Mrs. Bickle to Why find out. Why did he challenge that horrible man? Are you all right? We're looking for Mr. Bickle. My husband is dead. He killed him. Oh, I'm terribly sorry, Mrs. Bickle. Who killed your husband? Theophilus Harlow. I'm sure of it. He's been threatening my husband for weeks, and... Oh, where is my son? Where is Archie? I don't mean to be grim, but could Harlow have taken him? Archie's satchel is missing, so he may have left on his own. Hopefully he's just gone wandering, as he's prone to do. I hope he wasn't here when Harlow... When my husband... Do you know which way Archie might have gone? Um, he has a little hideout in the forest south of here. He never wanders far. But if he witnessed Harlow doing something to his father... Uh, I'm afraid to leave in case he comes back home. Jesus, what kind of smug look has my character got on his face? What reason would Harlow have to kill your husband? My husband had been looking into Harlow's dealings and discovered some of what he's been up to. I begged him to leave it alone, but he... He was convinced that... <laughs> Is there anything more you can tell me about Harlow? Oh, he's Victor Rookwood's second in command. A miserable, awful creature. Vicious and murderous. We'll find your son, Mrs. Bickle. Thank you. <sighs> what am I going to do? <laughs> Please do not worry, Mrs. Bickle. We will bring Archie home. Mrs. My Bickle's husband. son, Archie, is what missing. She mentioned that he has a hideout south of the hamlet. We should look there. When I took the letter we found to Officer Singer, she told me about Mr. Bickle. He had been doing the same thing we are, providing Officer Singer with evidence to take down Harlow. I had hoped to speak with him about what he had found, but we were too late. 
Incendio. Confringo. What did Officer Singer say about the letter you brought her? She thanked me, but she clearly felt that it was not enough. It is a shame that hippogriffs cannot speak. Your friend Highwing could provide all the evidence against Halo that we need. We will need something more. This must be little Archie's hideout that Mrs. Bickle mentioned. Archie? Archie Bickle! He would not have done this to his own hideout. Someone came here looking Revelio. for him. Revelio may be our only hope of finding out which way he went. There! Archie's footprints! He went this way! Using Revelio, we were able to uncover a series of children's footprints. We should follow them and see where they lead. I thought we would have found Archie by now. I suspect he'll keep running if he's being followed. If it is Harlow that's pursuing him, I only hope you're right. Men like Harlow would not think twice about killing a child. We must find Archie quickly. Revelio! cross paths with that wolf pack we should look around there are signs of disturbance in the area we should look for any clue that Archie was here Rebellion. Investigate. Archie satchel why would he leave it behind he was likely running from hollow distracted this may be a good time for Revelio again. Nae and I have found Archie's satchel in the area. He must have dropped it or left it behind for some reason. Archie went this way. I have a bad feeling about this. Halo must have a reason for pursuing Archie. I wonder what Archie saw. I hope he didn't see Harlow kill his father. He would never overcome it. At least not in any way I can imagine. Using Rebellion, we were able to uncover a series of children's footsteps. We should follow them to see where they lead. A fork in the road. We will need Revelio again. There are signs of a disturbance in the area. We should look for any clue that Archie was here. Multiple sets of footprints. Oh, Harlow caught up to him here. This is not good. They went this way. Expelliarmus! Leviosa! Oopsie daisy. Let's start getting ready to kidnap my yes, animals. They are beautiful, are they not? You can see Thestrals too. I witnessed death Rebellion. when I was nine. Saw my first Thestral shopping. 
I found in it. I still do. I think those of us who have witnessed death deserve some comfort. Found model sets of footprints and signs of distress. Archie could be in trouble. We need to follow the trail. Rebellion. Keep an eye on the footprints. I'm sorry you experienced something like that at so young an age. I was with my father when he died. My mother was away and I felt quite helpless. It was a long time ago in some ways, but in other ways, it seems like it was only yesterday. I still see him so clearly. You must miss him. My father was a wonderful man. I... <clears throat> Let us keep moving. Revelio. We must find Archie. All the trails led Natty and me to an Ashwinder tent. Hopefully Archie can be found inside and it's not too late. Hush now. Taking in children now, are we? Better not be expected to feed him. It is as I feared. They have Archie. Be on your guard. There can be no mistakes. We locked that brazen child up. Why bring the lad back here? Kill him and be done with it. Simple as that. This little fella isn't going anywhere. He's deep inside there, all locked up. They got what they deserved. Manipulation. Enter the Ashwinder tent. Oh wow, we've reached the interior of the Ashwinder tank. There are plenty of Ashwinders inside. We need to be careful while we search for Archie. Okay. I did not expect this. A latch on the inside. That complicates things a little. Yep. Revelio. Yeah, there was a fair amount of ash binders in here. You don't think he saw it happen, do you? He's just a child. We should release him. This is the sort of thing that could draw unwanted attention. I understand. Revelio. 
sneaky, sneaky, ooh, such a good time, sneaky, sneaky, bad guys in a line. Mm. Katrin Hargity, okay. Is that bestiary now? People. Catherine Hargady, uh, estranged from her brother Piedric, a local shopkeeper. Catherine Hargady turned to a life of petty thievery and tricks years ago. It wasn't until recently that she abandoned small scams for a chance of bigger fortune with the Archfinders. Okay. Ah, River Troll. No, that's a Forest Troll. All right, River Trolls. Uh, distance will not protect against an angry troll. Uh, it will tear chunks of the earth and throw them at its targets. After the troll slams its club to the ground with both hands, whipping it with Fependo. Okay. Fair enough. So the different forehand and backhand information. Okay. Ah, collected traits. I see. Oh, and it gives you a brief of uh, what they cost to make. Okay, that's not bad, actually. Not bad at all. Cool. I guess the soul bit red. I read them when I get them. I've just got a bit of OCD when it comes to that stuff. All right, there we go. All right. Uh. Oh, I'll my eyes. Well, that didn't work, did it? Let me The ball, sir. No, no, Rebellion. I'll be with you in a sec, Archie. Don't worry about it. Where's that? Oh, we chest. Manus. Rebellion. Give me a sec, Archie. Just taking anything that isn't tied down. Can someone help me? Is anybody there? Please. I need your help. Rebe Archie. Archie Bickle. How do you know who I am? Your mother sent us to find you. Oh, I'm so glad to see you. Not too loud, Archie. Sorry. We need to get this open. Nat and, Nat and I found Archie. Luckily, he seemed unharmed, but he's being held in a cage in the lowest level of the Ashfinder tent. We must unlock it to free Hello, him.
We've unlocked Archie's cage. Now to speak to him about how he got there. I'm Uncle Tarlow. He killed my father. We're so sorry, Archie. We won't let him get away with it. But first, we need to get you home to your mother. Thank you for saving me. We wouldn't have it any other way, Archie. Now let's get you home. We know a safe way back. That's pretty cool. Anyway. Oh, Archie, you're here. Oh, oh, you're safe. Mother, oh, mother. Father's friends are in danger. I heard the people who took me talking about them. Which friends, darling? Mr. and Mrs. Ray, Mr. Filbert, and I think they also said Otto's name. Oh. I shall speak with them. You run inside. Yes, mother. Your husband's friends may be in danger. Just as he was. How can we help? You've done enough. My husband was a powerful wizard and couldn't defeat Harlow. The last thing we need is that monster coming after you. It may be too late for that. I'm afraid Harlow's already after us. Then you needn't anger him further. I assure you, the threat could be a lot worse. Please, please keep your distance. I'm sorry again about your husband, Mrs. Bickle. Thank you. And thank you for bringing Archie home. I can never repay the two of you for your kindness. Not to worry, Mrs. Bickle. My father used to say that rain does not fall on one roof alone. We are here to help each other. I must learn more about Mr. Bickle's friends and why Harlow is after them. You'll be hearing from me as soon as I know something. Thank you for your help today. No problem. Okay. Well, we have stuff to finish off in that little corner of the world. These rocks have seen better days. Oh, God, okay. Levioso, defender. Oh, wow, okay. I wasn't looking at you. Expel the armors. Pin for Ingo. Arrest the momentum. Let 
Revelio. So what we got here? What's the little symbol I'm hovering over? Ah, oh, just there, there. Okay. Talents, the dark arts. Now we can restart improving our core. Also work on the room requirement stuff to get my potion and consumption up. Incendio. Dignified school robe. Okay. <laughs> Gently does it. Alright, let's sort this out first, actually. Oh, Ashwinder X. Cool. Let's see what's up your sleeve this time, Merlin. Mellow sweet. Ah, these again. Revelio. 
Okay. Defender. to be. Shame I didn't have an audience for that one. Incendio! Alright. Oh well, okay then. So that's that one done. Um, oh, let's see. Oh, we got more side quests about. Yes, we do. A thief in the night, a vendor in Irondale seems to be upset about something. I should introduce myself and see what it's about. Now yeah, I've got ancient magic hotspots. And then make my way down there, which is what I want to do, if I can. I shall see. But, until then guys, I'm just going to have myself a short break. And be back with you where I will do the quest um, of finding the poacher camp and getting Biscuit back. So then, again, thanks very much for your time and I'll catch you in the next one.